What's up guys, welcome back to the channel here today for a brand new video. Here today we're back with another reaction. Today we're going to be reacting to Tobey Maguire's reaction to Spider-Man No Way Home. Uh, I think it's a parody, I don't think it's real, I don't think he really reacted to it, but we're going to get some good laughs and I'm going to let you know what I think. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys hit that like button, smash the subscribe button, and turn on notifications for more content like this, man. Let's get it, man. Let's go. Let's get it, man. Let's go. Two minutes it ain't that bad, I mean... I loved the Spider-Man No Way Home trailer. I loved it. It was um, it was great. Uh, I don't know much else to say about it. If I'm being honest with y'all, I'm super excited for it. I hope nothing happens for it to be delayed. I know Venom got delayed. I'm not sure why it got delayed though. I know it got delayed because it didn't want to uh, basically be in the shadow of Spider-Man No Way Home. But there could have been other reasons that would probably that could possibly push back. I hope nothing happens, but. If, if if anything else gets worse or anything like that, Spider-Man No Way Home could get pushed back. I ain't going to cat with y'all. It, it was something that, it was just on my mind thinking about that, of how, like, if if, if things get worse, this could get pushed back, too. Because I can't really think of reason, real reasons why Venom got, Venom uh, let there be carnage. I, you know why it got delayed, but I know why it got delayed partially Spider-Man, you know, but I don't know. I don't know. I think it's some. I think it's something in Venom. It's weird. It's 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 a, it's a, it's a weird hypothesis. I ain't gonna get into it, man. But let's get it. Let's go. I'm really excited to watch the trailer to know what you're home. I'm also excited when it's pizza time. <laughs> Not true. <laughs> Damn, he thirsty. Hey, where's Harry? He was the best. <laughs> he said Harry. Wait, he tried to kill me. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> mm. It's kind of funny. I didn't have super friends back in my day. I had to carry the whole franchise all by myself. And Mysterio revealed my identity. My entire life got screwed up. Let me pause it right there, but that's true though. When people debate, bro, when people debate about who's the better Spider-Man, you gotta look at a few factors. Like, and who's stronger and all that. I mean, people that watched Spider-Man back then, like myself, Tobey Maguire is my favorite of all time. But, you, I, I mean, you could say Tom Holland's went through more. But he did have a lot of technology to back him up. He, you know, he, he fought a lot of powerful beings. But he did have a lot of backup. He did have a lot of tech to help him. That's not his fault. That's not his fault whatsoever. Tobey Maguire didn't. Tobey Maguire had to face these people with no tech. No type of tech. Literally. No tech. He just was fighting hand-to-hand -hand combat while others had technology as far as the Green Goblin. He had tech. Him, you know, and Harry Osborn had the tech, you know. So he was facing the people he was facing with no tech. So... By that standard, I say he's the strongest one without the tech. Now, imagine if he had the tech. He would have blew. Imagine if Tobey Maguire had the technology that Tom Holland has. He would have. He would have dominated the competition back then. That's just my opinion. But let's let's uh let's go. The part where that's my problem. I'm wondering if maybe you could make <laughs> it so that he never did. What's that, Uncle Ben? Right. Peter should take your advice, but you're not Tony Stark. <laughs> <laughs> The entire world is about to forget that Peter Parker is Spider-Man. Wait, everyone? Yep. In fact, I wish that uh, I could forget that you played him. Uh. <laughs> like, I love all of, I love Tom Hall and Spider-Man, but the debate you know is weird. what I want to in this kid's eyes? Yep, it's dirt. Lizard, <laughs> Electro Sandman, and Green Goblin are back? Cool. Yeah, man, cool. <laughs> Hey, he looks familiar. Where is he from? Okay, the only reason why I watched this trailer is because I thought that I was gonna be in this. Oh, gotta go. It's pizza time. <laughs> it's it's, it's okay. pizza time. But I mean, it, it's actually kind of crazy to me. That was a cool trailer. It's a shot at the end of the trailer where it has Spider-Man with his tech. The spikes the spikes are out in, in, in that frame it's almost as if two other people should be in that frame with them 
I think they edited out uh, Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire. I think they edited them out for the trailer because I think they're definitely going to be in those certain shots that they show in the trailer. In the movie, they will definitely be there, obviously. We know they're in the movie. They just trying to keep it hidden. I don't, I don't, I'm not sure if they're going to show them in any trailer. I'm really not sure. When I really think about it, I'm really not sure if they would do that. Because they want to keep it such a surprise so much that I think they would be willing to... I think they would be willing to keep them a secret until the movie actually drops. The teaser trailer... It's weird with teaser trailers to me because the teaser trailer showed a lot of stuff but it wasn't the actual trailer. So it didn't tease anything. It showed us everything almost. That, I mean, but it's so much that they didn't show, obviously, with the three Spider-Man, you know, the three Spider-Man or Spider-Mans, whatever you want to call it. You know, it, it wasn't. A teaser trailer is only like 20, 30 seconds. That was a trailer. That was a real trailer, you know. So I hate when they, I just hate, that was just a pet peeve of mine that they would do that, you know, as far as, oh, that's, this is a teaser trailer, this ain't the actual trailer, well, damn, I would, I would hate to see what the actual trailer look like, you hear me, I mean, if it's gonna, you know, if, if the teaser trailer showed all of this, we know who he's gonna be fighting, we don't know all, all three Spider-Mans, but we know who the villains are gonna be, we know how it really go down and how it starts with him and, with, uh, Tom Holland, Spider-Man, and Doctor Strange. So, but I I just can't wait to go and see this movie. I'm, I'm excited about it. But that, this was this was a fun to react to. I'm thinking I'm trying I'm thinking of doing two to three re reactions. I'm just trying to figure out what could get views. What you know, because at the end of the day, that's what it's about. Is you want to see your videos and stuff do good. Um, so I'm I'm trying to get around to doing two to three a week maybe. Um, but yeah, guys. I mean, that this was this was funny. This was funny because I just can't I. Personally, I just can't wait to get that nostalgic feeling from seeing because I we know Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield are in this movie. Now, I was able to watch all three of these guys: Tobey Maguire, Andrew Garfield, Tom Holland. I was able to watch all three of them. My favorite, Tobey Maguire, but I love Tom Holland as well. But there's no real debate. You can't debate because one had what the other didn't have. One has technology. Yeah, he went against more people. He went against way more people, but that's because he had a lot of characters and stars in his movies, and he just kind of naturally inherited those villains from those superheroes. He inherited the villains from, you know, Iron Man. You know, it, so you can't really compare the, the Spider-Mans, because if, if Tobey Maguire, I promise you, I know because I watched them. I watched all three of his movies. I didn't like Spider-Man 3, but it was, it was still a Spider-Man movie at the end of the day. If he had that technology, he would have blew the villains out of the park. It would not have been any competition. I'm telling you. It's just facts. But let me know in the comments, which Spider-Man do you guys like better if you've watched the other Spider-Man and uh, all that. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys hit that like button, smash the subscribe button, and turn on notifications for more content like this, man. I'm out. Peace.